Guys, welcome back to another episode of GNG News. So I went on Amazon and I decided to buy myself another pack of these Boss Monster paper and pixel cards. You get 14 cards in a pack. And I will just show you what these look like. I like these because they just remind me of Game Boy games just because of like the pixelated art on them. I think they're pretty cool. Uh, for the last pack that I got, I actually pulled one that had my name on it. So I thought maybe that says something. Maybe I should get some more. So this is a plus one counter if a card has an ability that gives a room a plus one place a marker on the room treat the room's damage as one higher for each plus one counter so um i forgot to explain this game is about essentially building your own dungeon um, and having monsters in it so the princess is the epic hero when the princess appears in town each player may draw up to three spells or room cards during the bait phase the princess is lured to the dungeon of the player with the most cards in hand. So we've got a spell deck card. Next we have the fireball. The fireball deals 1 to 6 damage to one hero in your dungeon and if you discard another spell card deal 1 to 6 damage to each hero at the entrance to your dungeon. Next up we have another fireball. We have a room deck. So we have the clockwork. Sorry, the clock tower. When you build the room, give it four plus one counters. At the end of each turn, remove one counter. We then have another clock tower, followed by a spell slime incubator. One per turn when you're when you cast a spell, give the room a one plus heart counter, followed by the same once again, followed by Hydra's Maya. One per turn when a hero survives this room, give this room a one plus heart counter. At the end of the turn, destroy this room if it had four counters. Same again. Oh, we have the Elder Portal. When you build this, give it two plus one heart counters one once per turn. You may remove one counter to make one opponent discard a spell card. We then have another Elder Portal. Uh, we have an Explodo. This looks so cool. Explodo. The, <laughs> the Ambassador. Level up for the rest of the game. Once per turn you may destroy a room in your dungeon to deal one to six damage to a hero in that room followed by a greg for the rest of the game whenever you build an ordinary monster room you may give it a one plus heart counter and a, ch <laughs> a chase variant no it's not a chase variant i think of the pop figures still uh, Chase, Mentor of Monsters. Level up for the rest of the game. Once per turn, you may discard an advanced room card to give one room a plus one heart counter. Thank you for watching the episode of GNG News. That was me very quickly opening up a pack of boss monster paper and pixels. This was 14 additional cards that you've seen me open. I'll see you all very soon. Have a good day. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on post notifications if you haven't done already. Like this video if you think it deserves a like, share it with your friends if you want other people to see this. Comment if you think there's anything I could possibly do differently in the next video. And I'll see you all soon.